In this video, I will show you our DLE engine throttle and choke linkage installation. Both linkages are made from nylon inner pushrod tube. The flexible nylon allows me to route the pushrods easily in the fuselage. First, I will install the choke linkage. The outer pushrod tubes have already been cut to length and glued into place. The pushrod tubes are lined up with the travel of the throttle choke arms on the engine carburetor. I installed ball studs onto the arms, but you can connect the pushrods in whatever way you see fit. I threaded a ball cup onto a threaded shaft and then into the inner pushrod tube. The pushrod fits through the hole in the firewall and into the outer pushrod tube already installed. A little pressure will snap the ball cup onto the stud. I'll install a clevis onto the other end using another threaded shaft. I need to thread the clevis onto the shaft until the clevis pin lines up with the servo arm. A clevis retainer will keep the clevis secured onto the servo arm. Set up the choke servo onto a two position switch on your transmitter and test it. If the servo binds or does not open and close the choke completely, adjust the length of the pushrod or use your radio endpoint adjustments. The throttle pushrod is set up the exact same way. You should use your throttle trim button to keep the throttle from closing completely at idle. Check out our next video showing how to drill and mount your propeller.